Cool. Hey, Paul. How's it going? Good, Ryan. How about you? Good. Um, yeah, so we are here in Tillamook's corporate office here in Slaptown, which is awesome. I've known you for several years. We've become good friends. You're the exec, exec vice president of stewardship here at Tillamook. But what I really want to get at is, on a personal level, mm-hmm. why you believe in Portland more than ever. Um, I think you still do. So, yeah, just tell us a little bit about that. Sure. Uh You know, my wife, Amy, uh, spent her high school years in Corvallis. Uh, And so as soon as she and I were together and coming out here to visit her folks, uh, we spent a lot of time in Portland. I fell in love with Portland decades ago. Mm -hmm. Um, And I always wanted to live here. Uh, I would every time there would be one of those like national polls about what are the best places to live in. Portland was always there. Right. So I was like, oh, I really, that's where I want us to land. And so eventually we found the right place or the right job that brought us out here. And it brought us out here seven months before COVID. Yeah. Um, uh, which was a really tough time for Portland. And I think there's a time for me where I was like, this is not what I thought it would be like. Mm-hmm. Um, uh, all those years of dreaming about living here. Mm-hmm. Um, but then I sort of stepped back and realized that what makes this place special are its people. Um, This city is populated by really, really passionate people. Uh, People that are passionate about their community, people that are passionate about their craft beer or their mountain biking or whatever you like. This city loves to enjoy life and celebrate it together as a community. Mm -hmm. And that endured through COVID and everything that we went through there. Um, And so while I might've had a little bit of doubt after I moved here, really quickly realized, no, this place, is a city that's better on its worst day than many other places on their best because yeah. of its people. Yeah. Um, and so I not only believe in Portland because of just that core of humanity that's here, uh, but I believe that we will not only drive ourselves to the places that a lot of people saw us before where we were on all of those lists, mm-hmm. but there's an even bigger, brighter future for Portland mm-hmm. because we've seen what it's like when we've not been at our best. And I think there's this energy around here about getting to an even greater place than we've ever been before. And I believe in that. I feel it. I see it. Mm-hmm. We talk about it. Uh, and I'm just thrilled to be a part of that. And so I'm so happy that my family and I are here yeah. uh, being part of this journey. And I know for a fact you're a great chef. You're a foodie. You're a mixologist. So, like, favorite restaurant that you can walk to here in Northwest? Bar Mingo. Okay. Bar Mingo. There we and go. It's just, it's just can't ever... Can't ever fail. Uh, that's our that's our go to. So yeah, uh, but you know what? <laughs> you could throw a stone from anywhere in Portland yeah. and hit five so places good. that are great. So great. Thanks. Thanks, Ryan.